Why the fuck are we doing this interview, dude? We're in Amsterdam. Let's go smoke a bowl. Laurie, hey, you're home early. Who are these girls? Oh, my God, where are my manners? Laurie, this is Angelique, Heavenly, Shireen, and Sauvignon Blanc. I swear to God, her name is Sauvignon Blanc. He'd get an erotic massage, and he'd uh, end up with uh, some prostitute's fist shoved up his ass. The movie is about me and this guy in our relationship. Hey Johnny, how about a beer, huh? And his being a bad influence and my having this. Dude, I'm trying to talk, man. We shut the fuck up. Sorry. Perhaps a Teddy Bruski? You're my best friend, John. I love you. But eventually, everyone grows up. It's about me and him and our relationship, and then my having this amazing girlfriend and her wanting me to be a little bit more of a, an adult and him being a bad influence on me. If you please ask Ted to move out so we can move on with our lives. I'm not that psyched to just, like, kick him out. Johnny, how about a beer, huh? <laughs> What do you think Seth MacFarlane has this uh, thing for talking, talking uh, animals? I think Seth, I don't know, maybe he's, uh, maybe he's into that sort of thing. But, you know, he's just one of the great comics of all time and, you know, a brilliant writer. He can say whatever the hell he wants. He, you know, there isn't anybody he won't offend. But he also, you know, he doesn't take himself too seriously. And, uh, and, you know, the movie has that great balance of really kind of raunchy comedy, but also has a lot of heart. Okay, all right, so that's where we'll draw the line. And there is uh, an amazing singing scene. Did you get uh, any advice from Nora Jones? For the I didn't get any advice from Nora Jones when I was doing the singing scene, and I don't think she knew what to expect, whether I was going to really try to sing this song. I sing uh, the theme song from Octopussy. And, uh, and I do a very poor job of singing it. And the crowd didn't know. We had 5,000 people in the crowd uh, in Boston at a very famous place where they have a whole outdoor concert. It's called the Half Shell. And they didn't know that it was supposed to be funny. So I think uh, when they started to have to boo, it came quite natural. That's my bad. I was sending a tweet. John. Hi, Thomas. How are you? Thank you. Thanks a lot. Right, thank you. Why are you crying? I'm drunk and squished by the TV. <laughs>